How is everyone doing today? First off, I would like to thank First off, I would like to thank Judge Manning and Justice Mitchell for their leadership in holding schools accountable for my right and quality to good education. For those who don't know me, my name is Damon Jones Way, and I am 18 years old and a member of the first graduating class of 2011 from Southern High School of Engineering. The program started in August of 2007. The time that Southern High School of Engineering had started, Southern had an overall proficiency rate of 40% on state tests and a graduating rate less than 60%. Um, also with 47 other seniors, I am part of the first graduating class to graduate from Southern High School of Engineering. When 96% of our class graduated this spring and only 45 of us have been accepted into college. Like, like it was said, I will, be, I will be attending North Carolina Agricultural and Technical University this fall to major in civil and or construction engineering. Next week on the 28th and 29th, I will be attending student summer orientation. I am very excited to attend that. Now I'm going to talk about Southern School of Engineering. The type of classes that we take are engineering courses, such as introduction to engineering, civil engineering and architecture, computer engineering technology one and two, principles of engineering and digital electronics. Um, out of all the engineering classes that I have taken, the classes are very helpful and they have learned me and they have taught me numerous things that I have never known about. Such things that we do in engineering classes are, we assemble bridges, take apart and reassemble computers, and also we assemble marble sorters. While doing such these activities, I have learned a whole lot about engineering in Southern. Southern School of Engineering is not only based off engineering courses, but the courses are college prep. Therefore, students will know what to expect when they go off into college. Southern School of Engineering is one of the new Durham public schools that focuses mostly on STEM. STEM stands for science, technology, engineering, and math. Throughout my years of high school, my classmates and I have done numerous things and numerous activities, such as our science class. Those science classes that are, those science classes that are taken in Southern School of Engineering are earth science, biology, and chemistry. We have also done numerous things, numerous activities and experiments. The activities include, such as burning two pieces of steel wool and then measuring to see which steel wool has the greatest mass. We also, mix chemicals together, and we also collect the fossils to match them to see which fossil group they belong to. Um, and also, our math class. Every math class that we do, we also do numerous activities. The activities that we do is um, we learn about a subject so we can get to know the subject a little bit more better. Those, those activities include making movies, posters, songs, and presentations. And also at Southern School of Engineering, there is two Greek organizations, a fraternity that I am currently in named Alpha Gamma Psi Fraternity and a sorority named Zeta Nu Sigma. The Greek organizations were established to get students more involved with Southern School of Engineering and, to, and so the students can become a more part with the school so they can get more involved in community service and scholarships. When I was a freshman in high school, four other friends and I were one of the first selected to be to participate in a program called Project Connect. Project Connect is a program where students use smartphones to help them with their schoolwork. Since technology is one of the most important things to a teenager nowadays, Project Connect is a good program to keep to keep teenagers connect, connected with technology and being able to focus on their schoolwork at the same time. Throughout the two years of me being a member of Project Connect. I have been Project Connect Student of the Year, also gave a public speech in Jacksonville, North Carolina, was Project Connect Student Representative three times. Also, Southern School of Engineering has participated in the Robotics Club two years in a row. With the Robotics Club, we were, students were able to come together and design robots, and they was, also able, they was also able to know what was wrong with the robot, and if anything was wrong with the robot, they was always to come together and fix it. One of the most important things that I like about Southern School of Engineering 
is that since with us being a very small school, all of the students and teachers were able to interact with each other very well. The support that I have received from my teachers at Southern School of Engineering stands out as one of the most greatest strengths. The teachers do a very great job at being there for students. And if a student is failing a class, a teacher is always there to help them, whether it's during, whether, whether it's before school starts, during lunch, or during the teacher's planning period. One of those teachers that I would like to recognize is Mr. Jason Giles. Jason Giles, could you please stand up, sir? <laughs> Mr. Giles was noticed this year, was noticed this year as Durham's School Teacher of the Year. He is a history teacher at Southern School of Engineering and represents what is best, what is best known about Southern School of Engineering. His main goal was to help students realize they can do something with their lives. He helped them see they can do it even when the students thought it was too hard that they couldn't do it. Mr. Jason Jowers motivates stu motivate students to pursue their dreams and he will never stop them to pursue their dreams until they have reached their goal. Jason Jowers shows excellent leadership and plays a good role at showing why he was named Durham Public Schools Teacher of the Year. Now I am going to talk about the principal, Mr. Travis Taylor. Travis Taylor, could you stand up, sir? <laughs> principal Travis Taylor has been the principal of Southern School of Engineering since the program started in 2007. Mrs. Taylor is a very fun and funny person to have as Southern School of Engineering's principal. Mr. Taylor is one of those principals that takes his education towards his students very seriously. He never thinks negative towards the students. He always thinks positive. If there is a student that is not in the right place with getting their education, he will put you in the right place and make sure that you stay there until you graduate. <laughs> Being a 2011 graduate from Southern School of Engineering, I feel that the school has prepared me very much for me to go into my major, which is civil and or construction engineering, um, as I will attend North Carolina Agriculture North Carolina Agricultural and Technical State University this fall. Southern School of Engineering right, might be a very small school, but with us being so small, every student, every student and the teachers are able to get along. The teachers, will never give, will, the teachers will never give up on a student, and they will continue their job to make the students feel well at home, as if the school was their very own home. I would like to also thank Mr. Taylor Jason Giles, the faculty and staff of All Southern School of Engineering, and also I, like to, I would like to thank Judge Manning, Justice Mitchell for the opportunities provided by the school. Thank you all and have a very pleasant day. <laughs>